this is Miwaka. Welcome back to my channel. I know, I know, I know that I've been kind of lost. I haven't been posting videos for around two weeks. It's because my mom came to visit me and I was also in my vacations and I did not have ready any videos. So I'm so sorry for that. I'm finally back. A few videos that I want to show you guys. I'm also gonna be making a makeup tutorial or like a makeup unboxing video because I want to show you a makeup palette that I got. Before I start with today's video, I wanted to ask you what do you think about my new background with all my cute plushies? Um, I've been playing around with stuff that I have in my room while I fix it. I know that I still haven't fixed my room. But yeah, this is what I have right now. What do you think about this? I think that it looks extremely adorable. It's not just the plain purple background and you can notice the real color of my background. On the rest of my videos, it looks very, very dark. So that's why I wanted to make a video here and not with my chair. So yeah, we're gonna be making videos, hopefully, from now on with my cute plushies as my background. So I hope you like it. So for today's video, I will be showing you some pieces of lacy old that I got in like a few months ago, but I never made the video because I was waiting especially for one dress that in the end was too big for me. So yeah, so yeah, without any more waiting, let's start with the first item. So the first item is this dress. It is a kind of like a old design but I really like it. It is pink and black and I love that combination. I think it was like a suit track something racing dress. I really like it. I always wanted this dress since I saw it on Doll's Kill. I think I got it on eBay. I love this charm. It's like a heart. Um, here it says lacy with a heart. It's an embroidery design. Each arm it has like a big ribbon with hearts and this is just black. This material is very, very stretchy. I don't know if you can appreciate it very, very well. I love that it has an elastic on the waist. And I also love that it has a long zipper. I can wear this also as a jacket instead of a dress. And the best part is the back, which has a big lacy of like logo. I really, really love this dress a lot. It's very comfortable. I'm glad that I got this dress. I got it in a size medium and large. So the second item was the dress that in the end, it didn't fit me and I wait like almost a month to get it. No other than this dress, the leopard dress. It looked very fancy on the website. I actually like this dress, but sadly it didn't fit me. I bought it from another seller, which took forever to send this to me. I got this dress in a size XX large because I thought that it was gonna be like very tight to my body or small but I was wrong this dress was super big on me especially in my boobs area because it's not like I have a lot I love that it's like simple but sexy kind of it, it's cute I love the embroidery heart in black and um, yeah it just it's just so cute uh, the fabric is like um, I would say denim but the material is super stretchy and I feel like I can get the X large one and be okay with it because as you can see here super stretchy and on the back it is an invisible zipper I am selling it on my Depop if you're interested on this dress uh, check the link below I will be uh, sharing my Depop account in case you're interested on any of this um, lacy elf items I'm gonna be selling few and maybe in the future I might sell some of the others because I don't think that I will be like buying a lot of lacy elf items like forever so yeah check it out <laughs> so sad that it doesn't fit me well because it was so so cute I would have loved to have this dress in my size the third item is another one that didn't fit me I mean it fit me but it was like one inch big uh, it's no older than this awesome skirt. I got this skirt on eBay and um, well, I was glad to get it but sadly it's one inch big on me. As you can see, it has like heart, black heart bottom and on the back it also has heart pockets which is so so nice. The material is very stiff as you can tell. 
did not look like extremely good on me I cannot deny that this skirt looks very elegant and very cute and it also came with the tag and it also came with the extra button which is so so nice I am going to sell this skirt on my teapot something that I wanted you to know is that when I got this skirt and if I arrived it had a, like a cigarette smell which was surprising because well I didn't expect that um, so I don't know how to clean this skirt so I will be selling it as is um, because I don't want to ruin it but yeah it still has a little bit of cigarette smell so I'm so sorry I don't smoke it was the owner that I bought this from and it also came in very good conditions because there is no like bad stuff going on on the lining so that is awesome. So sad that it doesn't fit me like, like I wanted. This next item is one of the Esther Love Shoe uh, Lacey Elf items. I finally got uh, two more of the items that I wanted from that collection. And it's no other than the well, jacket or blouse. But I really love it. It's so cute. It's so pastel. It really goes with my theme, with all my clothing, pastel clothing. I just have to get it. It's Lila cardigan it has very soft fur. I feel like it's as soft as the slippers of the collection and I pick it up in a size 14 and I feel like it's the perfect size and this is how it looks on the back. I don't know if you can tell very well. It was brand new and I got it from another seller because it was very big on her and this is the arms. It also has the fur which is so so cute. I cannot wait to take pictures uh, with me wearing this. <laughs> Next item is one that you have seen before and it's no other than the pink velvet dress. I love this dress a lot. I think this is from the gem collection if I'm not wrong. I just love this pink color. This is a velvet material. I don't know if I said earlier. It has like uh, gold bottoms which I feel like it's so cute. It has a uh, happy face on each bottom. I don't know you can tell. I just love it. I just love it so much and I really like how it look on me. This is a size X large. I love that it has the heart um, pockets over here and I also like that I can wear this as a coat if I wanted to because I can remove all the bottoms and it doesn't have actually anything on the back. I also remember that I got the beret. This beret is so cute from the same collection from the gem collection I just have to get this beret I am so lucky that I got it because another girl was selling it um, she had it with the tag and everything it was due uh, so yes yeah, she sold it to me but I just love this beret so much like I'm not wearing it right now because honestly I don't know why because it looks very cute with this stuff but I'm just gonna tell you that I wish I had like bought like two of these because it's unique and it's cute and I love barrettes so yeah it's a fluffy material I feel like it's the same fluffy kind of material as the bunny slippers and the purple um, jacket or blouse and it has hard like rhinestones and on the inside has like a silk type of material and it has a pink ribbon I really honestly love this beret so so much I'm happy that I got it this is one of my favorite items from all the stuff, all of Lacey Elf that I have. <laughs> so the next item is that dress actually that I got on eBay. But I did not actually like how it looked at me because it's tubular and it doesn't go well with my... I think it's an apple figure. It's no other than this dress <laughs> which has the most weirdest um, arms. It reminds me a lot of the mask. My boyfriend told me like I look like the mask when I was wearing this. So yeah. But yeah, it's a whole long dress in pink. Tubular pink with no curves or whatever. With this humongous arms. This is what I like. But when I was wearing it, I just kind of look weird. Uh, I decided to wear it um, as a top and not as a dress even though that I don't like that it's a tubular like dress I'm gonna wear it as a top tuck it inside of a skirt a white like pleated skirt or any type of skirt uh, it looks very nice actually it doesn't have any designs or anything like that on the back 
it's a very very stretchy material and this is a size medium to large and it's super heavy by the way I don't know if I should keep it or if I should sell it because it was kind of expensive I mean most of the lazy old stuff is expensive anyways but yeah it's very unique and the last item which I feel like I wait too long. Uh, I got it from the Lacey of website, I think, or Dolls Cure, I don't remember. No other than the bunny jumper. I wait so long for this because it was sold out all the time. In the end, I don't know if I should keep it because I only tried it on once and I don't know if it looks good on me because of the crush area. It looks like, like here is my crush and here's where the pants ends. So, I am not sure. I also pick it in size 14 because I saw a lot of people saying that this runs big, so I decided to get it in a smaller size. And even though it's 14, I feel like it's still big. So, yeah, almost all of you know how it doesn't look like. I'm just showing you um, that I finally got it. <laughs> I also had to roll. The end of the pants like up to here because I'm 5'1 and this was extremely long on me I don't know if it's me or I feel like this looks better on someone who is tall what I know is that it fits me perfectly on the hips like this part over here fits me perfectly I don't know what to think about this crush area because again like I said my crush ends like up to here um, I still have a lot of room between my legs so i don't know if that's normal i like the bunny jumper i mean it's my favorite color and it's cute but again i don't know if i should keep it because i don't know if it looks good on me i don't know let me know guys what do you think about this did you like it i also never had a jumper from lacy elf so i don't know i cannot judge from the from the other collections that they had there you have it so guys, this is everything that I've gotten so far from Lacey Ove after the bunny collection. I went a little bit crazy because I got most of this stuff like one after the other like really fast of, of for the last past two months. So I went a little bit crazy and you know Lacey Ove prices. So yeah, <laughs> I don't know if I should keep everything. I might sell a few and I don't know if I should keep buying a lot of Lacey Ove stuff unless they're on sale unless on their shelf and um, also I have this issue like most people that don't know what size are they because they run so different from collection to collection so that it's kind of annoying so yeah so guys let me know in the comment below how many pieces of Lacio do you have or if you love Lacio so much that you get almost every little thing from every collection that they release Anything that you want to say, let a comment below. So guys, this is everything for today's video. Don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to my channel for more kawaii content. Also, I want to keep reminding you guys that we are almost 1,000 subscribers. Uh, we are so just so, so close. I'm thinking on doing a giveaway when I reach my 1,000 subscribers. I've been wanting to do one for a while, but you know, life happens. If we reach 1,000 subscribers, I'm gonna be doing a giveaway. Obviously, a kawaii giveaway. If you don't wanna miss that giveaway, you better be supporting my channel. So thank you very much for watching and I hope to see you next time. Take care.